Let me start that over. Wow, that was embarrassing here. I was just too eager. <laughs> Way too eager. Uh, folks, my name is Andy with Andy Vlogs. I forgot to uh, plug my mic in. <laughs> you want to know why? <laughs> my iPhone came. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> How embarrassing. Uh, I don't hear the audio. I don't hear the, the, the music going. So give me one second. Man, this is... You've all started off on the wrong foot. There we go. Okay. Now we're there. Now we're there. Okay. Pungyos, thanks so much for joining us. I'm so sorry that we started off on the wrong foot. <clears throat> I, uh, well, I made a boo-boo in not plugging in my microphone. And so I, I literally was talking to myself for the first three or four minutes. But now we're all good. Uh, I'm really distracted because I thought this was going to come later tonight. It came right before our live stream. So in addition to obviously all of the accessories that you see here, all the MagSafe compatible accessories, uh, we are going to be unboxing for you live on stream the iPhone 14. Now my Pro Max is coming in October. I haven't had a chance to pick up the uh, Pro, uh, but as you guys can see, I'm elated here and we'll be able to show you guys without a dummy phone, a real phone, the MagSafe capability. I love MagSafe. I think I thought it was a gimmick at the beginning, but it's a really cool feature that you can uh, level up your game. So we'll show you all that here. So let's go ahead and uh, put everything aside, unbox the iPhone, turn it on and then start MagSafe accessory review. Uh, make sure you guys down below in the comments let me know which one you guys are looking to pick up otherwise let me know um, if you have any questions this is a live stream and i can see all your chats which is good i want it to be interactive okay so first and foremost let's go ahead and shift gears to opening my iphone i i just sure hope that the uh, iphone 14 has I just sure hope that the iPhone 14 has the uh, cinematic 30, uh, 4K 30. That's what I'm really excited about. So live here on stream, let me go ahead and open up my iPhone just for you. I haven't seen it yet. I always forget there's a second one. Last time I opened it last year, I forgot to get this second little tab and I let my iPhone just flop all over the place. Dang, look at that. It's beautiful. It's glorious. There it is. No time a wasting. Let's go ahead and peel off paper, hold down the button, let it turn on here for you. There it is, boom. Ooh, look at those bezels. Those bezels are a little bit thicker than I am uh, I'm prepared for. It comes in quite a bit, uh, which is unfortunate. Uh, fortunate for me, I do have a case to be able to place on this. So we're gonna be uh, placing the iPhone uh, MagSafe leather case. So this is going to be our first product here uh, showcasing today the iPhone 14 MagSafe leather case. This is a beaut. Love it. Where'd it go? I unboxed it yesterday and now it's not here. <laughs> this is all kinds of messed up. How is it right here? It was right here. Yes, here it is. I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen, that was a big blunder. I've already unboxed this, uh, this leather case for you. So let's go ahead and place it in there. Um, oh, nice. Is it going to do the MagSafe animation? No, it's not because it's in the hello mode. It's not going to do the MagSafe animation. That's the only, that's the only plus of this phone is being able to put it inside and having it click at you for being MagSafe. So uh, with that said, we're going to uh, go ahead and move forward to the next product here. Um, this is my go-to. As much as I rag on it, I, I bought it. This, this, this product has bothered me for some time now, but as soon as they updated the uh, output to 5.7 watts, and yes, I have a pile of MagSafe here. 
Um, let me clear off my desk so I can have this more readily available. Clear off everything. Okay, there we go. So I this thing has bothered me. It is too small. It's it's like 1600 milliamps, 1800 milliamps. They, they, they don't ever mention it on the website or on their product pages because it's so little. Uh, but I love that it's so little. And I love how it's just MagSafe compatible. That's, I love that. It's so light, it's so sleek, it's just easy. It's supposed to give the iPhone 14 at least one or maybe um, maybe a half of a charge. I mean, two, 2,000 milliamps, that's maybe 60% of the phone. Uh, for a Pro Max though, you're gonna only get about 30 to 40%. Um, honestly, that's about as much as I got. But what's nice is it's efficient, it doesn't overheat and it's 7.5 watts. So that's what I recommend here. Um, this is the first MagSafe product, well, technically second MagSafe product that I recommend. Uh, it's really nice and uh, silicone-y, like really soft. I'm pretty sure this is a soft silicone. It is, um, like it depresses. Uh, it's very, very thin, very, very small. Again, it's like the width of your iPhone. And uh, it, it can fit in a back pocket, it can fit in your backpack very simply and it gives you a good charge in a pinch i mean it does what it's supposed to that's its um ultimate goal uh thanks so much everyone for joining us appreciate it if you hit that follow button it'd be uh it'd help out the channel a lot we're trying to build up my storefront uh next product here is uh, a new a new product that i haven't tried out before until now uh, This is the uh, MagSafe leather wallet. They've had this ever since um, the Apple, uh, excuse me, MagSafe has been brought into MagSafe sphere. It's really cool. It's a it's a it's a very I think unique piece. It's genuine leather, um, although it's vegan leather, so it, I don't know how genuine that can be. It is a dark color. You can get in a couple of different colors. It fits up to three cards, as you can see. You pull it off and it like slides, which is kind of cool. So I've got my uh, credit cards here. Just place it right on there. It, it fits perfectly. It does have an animation. So once I get past this, I can't wait to see what the wallet animation is. It's not necessarily showing me because of the uh, hello. I want to go past that. Uh, nonetheless, it's uh, it's pretty sleek. It's really lightweight. Uh, I think it'll match whatever case that you decide to put it on. I've got the midnight case as well as the midnight wallet. And that, that looks really cool. I like that. Especially on this little phone, it uh, it doesn't make it much thicker, and it's I, I like how it's bezeled here, so it grips and you can grab grasp all the way around it. I like that. I like that touch. Like I said, it holds up to uh, three cards. I'm gonna make sure that I don't expose my credit cards here. I have them faced both the wrong. Oh crap! <laughs> Dang it. Uh, it it fits two cards. It fits two cards. Uh, probably shouldn't put three on on camera, but uh, there it is. Uh, nonetheless, there's your wallet. That looks really great. I'm going to get close here so you can see the embossed Apple sign. Pretty impressive. I like how it's sewn. I always like leather work. I kind of want to get into leather work. High quality. All righty. Nextly here, I'm going to go over another Apple product. Uh, this is the MagSafe Duo it's for you traveling folks. This is my go-to when I uh, go traveling. We're going to be going camping this weekend, and uh, this is my go-to. There's a big glare here from the big old studio lights that I've got, but it's nice. It's really compact. It's probably the width of the... Uh, where did that go? The wallet. I checked the wallet. I probably can't check. I checked the wallet in there. There it is. It's it's about the, the width of two wallets. And uh, it's supposed to output, I believe, five watts here and five watts there. Charges real nice and fast. You can put your Apple Watch on there if you want. Uh, nextly here, I'm going to go to uh, the Apple. No, that's it for Apple. So the next one is uh, now our third-party line. Um, we're going to go over now a series of third-party products for your iPhone. Um, these are ones that I recommend that I think that are best in their class and we'll go over all of that here for you. Um, I wanted to showcase here its lighting 
and I need to grab my charging. So give me one second here. There's a, there's a re means to my madness, folks. Okay, so I've got my plug. I've got my 60 watt charger. I'm gonna go ahead and show you here uh, this um, MagSafe three in one from Morpiso. I like this a lot. Uh, this I found to be my go-to. Uh, I used to use my uh, Duo, but because now I've got my AirPods, I've got the uh, AirPods right here. I've got AirPods, Apple Watch, and now my iPhone. So let's go ahead and show you here as my camera goes out. There we go. When it rains, it pours, guys. I'm sorry. I'm not a professional. I just enjoy products. So I'm trying my best. We're a one man show. Okay, so uh, this is really cool. If I can get it to work, there we go. You go, it's got RGB. That's so cool. It goes from blue to red to green, all these different cool colors. Let's show you that again. Close up. It's so cool. I love that blue. It goes green when it's ready to charge. What's also nice, you got these little flaps. So when you, when you go like this, you can make it like a desk buddy and you can have your uh, iPhone just chilling, which I'll show you in a second. Let's go ahead and uh, place on all of the different products. Apple Watch charges, AirPods charge. Now my iPhone 14 charges. Changes colors when they're all on there and it pulses to show you that it's charging. Isn't that cool? I really like that. Found that to be an awesome MagSafe product. Take one of them off, charges blue. Put them all on, it goes from green to blue, which is really cool. And then, like I said, you can do that desk buddy thing where you place it like this and it can stand up like a, like a little desk buddy, isn't that cool? You can Netflix and chill while you're charging. I like that. It's a pretty, it's a pretty handy product here. All right, next on my list is going to be uh, a, a new product from Anchor. Anchor, uh, they, you know, they're kind of struggling. I'll be honest. Um, what I mean by that is um, they're obviously known for their, their high capacity power banks. And, uh, you know, some of them are quite frankly amazing where they can output to like 40 watts on a battery, which is crazy. Uh, nonetheless, these MagSafe uh, battery packs that they've come out with are kind of meh. So the last two years, they've come out with the 633, the 622, and the 621 now. All different sizes, shapes, and the 621, uh, I'll admit, I've, I've had it now for about a month, or no, excuse me, I've had it now for about a week, and uh, it's growing on me. Uh, what happened to it? I have this big pile of products. Here they are. It's right here. That's cool, yeah. Thanks, Darren. Like I said here, um, here is the product. It's much, much smaller than last year. I lost my other year. Uh, I lost the one I bought two years ago, and I gave... Uh, the one that I bought a year ago uh, to my sister-in-law who bought the 12. So I don't really have anything to compare it with besides, you know, the other uh, MagSafe products. But look, it's about the same size. It's nice. They finally come down to about the same size as the Apple. It's a little bit taller. Um, it's a 5,000 milliamp, so it's about twice the size as the Apple. But look at that. Look how thin that is. It is about the same width as the Apple. Granted, Apple hasn't refreshed this, so 
it's taken what two iterations for anchor to get on the ball but what's great here is that it's supposed to output um 7.5 watts which is nice so pretty straightforward getting your iphone throw it on there there's your notification that it's charging and uh, for this little tiny iphone 14 it covers the whole back but what's nice is it doesn't get in the way of the camera lens which i think is uh really really nice or nice take You've got an indicator here on the back side. It takes USB type C. You can output charge through this. I believe it's 20 Watts, which is nice. So you can charge two different products. You've got your led light and your button here. But what's nice is uh, when you, when you click on it, MagSafe, it recognizes it and you don't have to push the button, which I think is a nice touch. Alrighty, let's go ahead and move on to uh, the little bit higher powered uh, MagSafe compatible uh, no, I got one more 5,000 milliamp here for you. So this, this is uh, my second favorite go-to. Um, when I'm on a camp out, when I'm headed out on a trip, this is what I bring. I don't bring the, uh, the apple. When I'm domestic, like within my town and my uh, little city, I bring the MagSafe with me because I know I'll need it. Uh, but this is more long-term. This is a, a higher capacity 5,000 milliamp battery that I've had for forever, and I really like it. Um, the iWalk, uh, 5,000 milliamp, uh, battery powered or MagSafe powered, uh, device, I think is something that you guys should consider, uh, for a couple of reasons. So it's got, um, USB type C comes with the charger. You push the button to show you the led lights. It's got a little interface here, which is cool. And then it's got this cool little key ring that, uh, not only acts as stability, which is great when you put place it on, but. It's strong enough to hold up your phone, which we'll show you. Very straightforward application. You just place it right on there. Starts charging, gives you the animation. It's great. It's supposed to be 7.5 watts, which is fantastic. It's about the, the, the back and width of my iPhone 14. The ring here can be used as a, de a desk buddy, which is nice. See that? Isn't that great? It's a great little product. What have I done? There we go. See that? Really cool. Acts as a nice little desk buddy. Also, you can hold it here if you want to run. Gives you a nice grip. It's supposed to hold about maybe two pounds, like 10 Newton, not Newton tons. I don't know my, uh, I don't know my weight, uh, whatever they're called. Nonetheless, this is, uh, uh, what I go to here. Let's go to the higher capacity uh magsafe uh chargers uh so i'm gonna do another i walk i walk is they've been killing it they uh they have a whole line of, of really awesome battery powered uh, battery banks uh this is the 9000 milliamp battery it's much much bigger much thicker it's about three of the widths of the anchor uh but this is again if i'm going out camping overnight i don't have a charger 9,000 milliamps will charge this two times, two and a half times. So you know that you'll be saved. You'll have enough power. It does have a USB type C to output. With that said here, it is a, a little bit bigger girth. It does have an interesting shape where it's cylindrical here. And then it kind of outputs to more of the body of it, which kind of cool. It looks like a jetpack on your, on your phone, placing it on your phone here, straightforward. It, it, it kind of pushes off from pushes off from the phone it's kind of interesting but it definitely weighs it down it's really heavy but this is 9,000 milliamps I mean you place this down like this put it on your backpack put it in your fanny pack it'll charge overnight just fine output 7.5 watts the uh, I believe this right here outputs 10 or 15 there's your MagSafe animation looks great it's a really nice all-around product that I recommend uh, we're going to go to the next biggest capacity, which actually looks smaller. This is my go-to as well. This is, well, let me rephrase that. This is what I give my wife <laughs> when she goes to Disneyland. Unfortunately, she's, well, currently she's at Disneyland and she forgot it, unfortunately. So um, that was my bad here. But look, this is uh, about the size of the Apple MagSafe battery pack. Show you in comparison. But it's like 
three or four times the size. This is 8,000 milliamps, believe it or not. It's nice, it's got two different ports that output 20 watts each. So in total, you can have like 45, 50 watts output. It does output um, 7.5 watts on the back through wireless Qi charging, so you can connect it to, uh, it is dead. Oh, no, it worked, there we go. It just takes a little bit longer for it to turn on. And then you can simultaneously charge other devices here up to 20 watts um, for those USB type C. So it's pretty nice. I like it. It's very compact. It's pretty lightweight. Fits right in my palm. It's a great little product product there. I forgot to tap it. It's called the Oweasel 8000. O Oweasel. O Say that 10 times. Oweasel. When it's uh, fully charged, it's blue. When it's dead, it's purple. Alrighty, moving on here to the uh, next product. Uh, this is the biggest. Uh, but this is also one of my, I always say they're my favorite. These are all my favorite. Uh, but this is this is one I need to, you know, create content on the go. When we go to California to visit family, this is my go-to in the car. Uh, the car doesn't draw enough, you know, battery power to uh, start charging my device, uh, my MacBook over there, which you can't see. Um, what's nice about this is this will output quite a bit to the MacBook and charge it. Now, um, it does have MagSafe here on the front, and then it's got a bunch of I.O. on the uh, on the top. Coming closer here, it is uh, about the length of your iPhone. It's about two times the width, maybe three. It's big. It's heavy. It's like five, six pounds. I mean, you can lift weights with this. It has a nice little kickstand here, which I'll show you in a second. MagSafe in the I.O. is two 3.0 USB and then a USB Type-C. And they can all simultaneously, uh, if you check out the uh, review of this, I have four products charging simultaneously. Now it does throttle the output, so it probably reduces this to five, these to probably five to 10, and this probably to 10. You'll have to look at the, uh, the information guide. Uh, all right, connecting it here, pretty straightforward. I like how it protrudes out, so it gives you a flush connection. Push the button, it'll start charging. Give you the, the uh, animation for the Qi charging here in a second. There it goes. And then you've also got a nice little uh, LED light to show you the percentage, which is cool. I like this. And then lastly, you can turn it into a desk buddy, which is great. Got a little desk buddy. If you want to do TikTok, if you want to do Netflix and chill, want to watch YouTube videos, it's pretty cool. I like it. Uh, all right. The, the last but not least MagSafe battery pack is going to be this beast. Um, believe it or not, this is one of the most popular that I've come across. It is bulky. It is big, but uh, it's nice. This is, uh, I don't even know how to pronounce this. It's like the Orang Guru or something like that. Um, but this is a 10,000 milliamp wireless charging battery pack. And uh, it's like the size, just to give you a comparison, it's about two times the width of the MagSafe battery pack from Apple. It's, it's much longer. So zooming in here, showing you what that looks like. It's pretty plain, unbranded. You get your MagSafe circle, which kind of goes up to the the ridge line which is kind of interesting it kind of hangs out like that and then you got your io button and percentage fairly lightweight if you want something that's just anonymous if you want something that uh no one can tell about this is your go-to uh as you can see here it is longer than the iphone and i think they wanted to make sure that they didn't get in the way of the camera bump here that's why you've got the magsafe all the way up to the top Careful consideration. I think that's nice. Again, if you're just placing this to place um, overnight, 10,000 milliamps will, re or will charge this quite a few times. In order to execute it, to turn it on, push the button. You can see the LED. It'll uh, MagSafe charge. I believe at, at five watts. Uh, 7.5 watts, I stand corrected. You've got a USB Type-C as well as a USB 3.0, which is nice. 
It's real nice. Sometimes you just want an unbranded, sleek, MagSafe charging case, uh, charging battery. All right, next up here is, for some reason, this product is no longer on, on the website. It's really weird. So I know that shift cam just came out with uh, a Kickstarter where they are improving the pro grip. Um, they're making it mag safe. However, their product that they released last year or so the pro grip is mag safe compatible. And it's one of my favorite go to running gun uh, grips. It's fantastic. There's a number of features on this that I can't go without. So this is my go to I bring this to Disneyland. Uh, I bring this to uh, you know basketball soccer games for the kids. Um, this is my run and gun for vlogging, which I will be bringing uh, for our camp out tonight. Um, so I'm going to show you here what are, what some of the features are. First of all, you've got this articulating grip, so you can do uh, horizontal and vertical video uh, for TikTok and Reels. It's got a nice uh, full leather grip. Around the front here, you've got a dedicated Bluetooth shutter button and a um, cold shoe mount. So you can put like a, a light or a microphone on it. Right here on the center point is a MagSafe Qi charge. So whether you're on Android or iOS, it is uh, MagSafe compatible. Battery here and you can connect everything right there. It's got a quarter inch mount, charging. It's amazing. <laughs> it's fabulous. And uh, what's nice is that when you couple this with their um, drop-in lens mount, you can connect it to some lenses, uh, which I'm not ready to show here, but um, I wanted to show you that you can charge it. So you hit the Qi charge button, place it in, it grips it, which is nice, full battery. Hopefully it'll start charging. I might not have it in the right spot. There we go, you have to find the sweet spot. There it is, it's great. Turn it like that if you wanna have it as like a desk buddy. Turn it like this, looks great. You can video like that. You push the shutter button, it's like that. And uh, you can utilize um, some of their products there that I've, I've, I've showcased there on the um, carousel. All right, the next um, more run and gun filmmaker type product that I wanted to showcase is from the folks at Moment. This is a filmmaker rig, cage, whatever you want to call it. Oh. There goes everything. <laughs> I just dropped everything. <laughs> Whoopsie. Man, this is like the most embarrassing I've ever done. Hold up. Not cool, Andy. Not cool. Okay. All right, so a lot of people have complained about this not being that safe. Um, I found it to be fine. Uh, I mean, if you're gonna be like running around following folks in the city, doing parkour, if you're doing, you know, really technical um, running and gunning, this this isn't necessarily for you, but if you wanna place it on a tripod and have panning, tilting, all that good stuff, um, this is something that I recommend. It's MagSafe powered uh, grip. So it's got these two grips here, um, and it's got a whole bunch of um, accessories, you know, quarter inch mounts or, or three fifths uh, mounts that you can place. It's got two cold shoe mounts, which is fantastic. And then it even has this built in um, uh, tripod mini, the tripod pro mount, uh, the small one that you guys can put. This can come off if you want. Um, zooming in here, as you guys can see, it's made out of brushed aluminum, I believe. Really high quality. You got um, accessories here if you wanted to attach anything to it. You got a little cord notch there, cold shoe mount. If you wanted to have a like a handle grip, it's fantastic. Very versatile. You can mount it to a tripod. It's really, really cool. So we're going to go ahead and place uh, my phone on it. MagSafe compatible, like I said. Very, very strong magnet. This ain't going anywhere. I mean, if you're like jumping and dropping and bobbing and it's really heavy, yeah, it might come loose, but I mean, look at that. It's fine. It's fine how it is. I really like that. You can add uh, a myriad of different products, like the Rode Video Mic 2. 
This is a an accessory I recommend. You do need to have the adapter for this. So because it's uh, lightning, you got to get a lightning to 3.5 millimeter. Nonetheless, cold shoe mount. You can place it right on top. If uh, if I can get it to tighten, why isn't it tightening? Tighten it here. There we go. If you want to place it, you got some cable management right here. That's really cool. I mean, look at that. You get your little running gun. You can add another thing if you wanted to add professional level audio. It looks great. Something I highly recommend. Uh, like I said here, uh, built uh, onto it here that comes in the package is this uh, the Moment Pro tripod mount small or, or mini. It's not mini, but it's short. It's the shortened one. Um, this one does not have the cold shoe mount. And I can't get that untied now. There we go. The cold shoe mount um, is not this specific one. I didn't see this one available, but that's the size of it. Let's go ahead and shift gears here now to uh, the last remaining products that I wanted to showcase today. There's a couple of uh, products from Moment. The same um, Nomad. Excuse me, not, why did I say Nomad? Moment um, MagSafe line. Here they are, these two. So you've got that same, you've got that same um, style and build, but this is for vertical phones. So if you wanted to get a tripod, you can connect it to this. It's the Tripod Pro MagSafe by Moment. It's very durable, super strong. Connects right there. You align it and you can have a tripod. I need to get the tripod legs. That's what this product is. Next one is uh, if you wanted to wrap it around a bar or something. So for instance, if I wanted to wrap it around my microphone, boom, arm, you can. Granted, I would not put this on handlebars, something that's static, because again, it's a magnet. So if you wanted to get that shot from a boom arm like that, I just need to tighten it better. That's why it's kind of floppy. I have to tighten it. You've got quite a few little rungs there to choose from. But uh, yeah, it fits right there on the back. If you had a static shot that you wanted to put around a bar or something. Lastly here, um, I already showed you the microphones. I wanted to go over one last product that uh, I would recommend. This is for your car. Take me a, a, just a second to get set up. I can find all the products. falling, man. Okay, so this is um, a wireless charger from the folks at Joy Room. I really like this. Uh, this incorporates MagSafe charging as well as a phone grip. Um, so you've got your um, well, hold on before I jump into it. Okay. So it's based on basically a ball and head joint. You got this thumb screw, you place it on, you screw it. And then this will clip on to your AC vent. You can stretch it out and then it'll grip on however wide it is. It has these um, additional uh, extensions to give you more of a stable grip. Uh, but what's really cool here is that when you plug it in, it's like it's got a mechanical aspect to it. It's, <laughs> it, it retracts and, and it closes. It's pretty cool. So you throw your iPhone on there, it closes and then starts charging. Isn't that amazing? And it also changes colors right here. It's so silly, <laughs> but I love it. This is my go-to on my car. I had to run out and uh, take this off, but, but yeah, this is uh, this is definitely, um, you know, I think one of my favorite products that I've gotten more, more recently. It, incorpor it incorporates RGB, it incorporates uh, MagSafe, and it uh, it's mechanical and it can fit on your car. So if you wanted to 
you know, do Uber Eats. You needed to have something there to charge your phone while you're doing your tracking or whatever. Uh, that's that's there for you. All right, guys. Well, those are some of my favorite products there uh, that I'd recommend when it comes to uh, MagSafe accessories. I am going to log into my account and enjoy this phone for the rest of the weekend. I will be back with you guys next week. Thank you so much. And we'll have a couple more videos to show you. Uh, with that said, my name is Andy with Andy Vlogs. Uh, I love everything Apple. I love vlogging and I love uh, products that uh, boost your lifestyle, um, make things more reasonable and efficient, and also um, allow you to vlog because I'm a big vlogger. Hit that like button down below, guys. Uh, please follow. Please subscribe. All those things. With that said, uh, we'll leave you. We'll leave you at that. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.